Good morning. Happy another day of Vlogmas. Okay. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome back to my current subscribers. You know, I love you. Thank you so much for tuning back in, for loving me, for liking, for commenting, for sharing, for doing all of the wonderful things, just for even watching, giving me a view, honey. I love it. And to the new faces, to the newcomers, come on, click that subscribe button. Go ahead. Tell the people, tell all your cousins, your brothers, tell them that you found a new YouTuber and you think she's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, so I've gotten up, you know, done all the wash your face, brush your teeth, slick your hair back, because I didn't want to look like, um, I'm just not going to say what I did not want to look like. I just did not want to look like it. And praise God. So I tried to do something or another. I'm about to go downstairs, fix me a cup of coffee. <laughs> um... Fix me a cup of coffee. I think I have like one of those biscuits left over, so I'm gonna eat one of those. And then we're gonna get into the day. Today we're gonna do a cleanup day because my room desperately needs to be cleaned up. So we're gonna do that, but we got some work to do. Got some work to do, so I'm gonna try to knock out as much work as possible so that I will have time to clean up my room. I would love to clean up my room before like three o'clock hits. So that's when Miles gets home and usually around that time, I'm just not able to do too much of anything once he gets home. So yeah, um, prayers, it's about 9.30. Um, I woke up pretty early and then I fell back asleep. Um, I got up again about 8.30 and I was like, I need another hour. And I feel like I could sleep for like four more hours, but we're not going to do that, right? Because it's not productive. All right. I was headed downstairs, but then I stopped because can anybody drink and walk at the same time? Or is it just me and I might be a little slow? Um, I cannot drink and walk at the same time. Lord bless my, my poor little heart. Um, It's actually getting cold here in Texas. The house is freezing. But, you know. I ain't gonna complain. <laughs> Let's put on some clothes, but now we're downstairs. Yes. 65 degrees. And, uh, yeah. Let's get into it. Yeah. So, hey, y'all. So, I'm currently trying to edit, and my computer just, like, it was acting dumb. So, trying to um, let's log back in. I've had my coffee and everything like that, and I ate, I think, like, one of those bites literally, like, does it for me. Um, the little biscuit things. But... Now I feel like I want a snack. It's just kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, so I'm trying to finish up editing so I can clean up. Because I did tell you guys that I was going to clean up today and I want to be a woman of my word. But my computer is like acting funky right now. So I'm trying to get it. My boyfriend is being so loud playing the video game and um, doing all of the things that he's doing. So, restarting computer, trying to get everything together. Um, and I did a little, you know, YouTube case study, like trying to watch other vloggers because I do like to actively support other people in their vlogs as well. A lot of people are doing vlogmas actually this year. Um, so I'm trying to be supportive and watch their content as well. So trying to do that, but, um, I currently have two 16 subscribers y'all and I just, 
I'm excited. Like, 216? Like, that's crazy. And I started my YouTube channel in August. Um, It might not seem like much to y'all, but it's much to me. And so I just thank y'all for being consistent and sharing and getting the word out. And thanks to YouTube for pushing my content, seeing that people, you know, want to look at it. And so I'm just so excited. So, yeah, now I'm about to edit today's vlogmas lately my vlogmases have been getting out in the evening so I'm, I'm gonna try to put them out put today's out earlier and see where i get with that and see if that um helps the views because my views have gone down but again i will say because i am a new youtuber and there are quite a few people doing vlogmas this year and there's a lot of people that now have started like with just 12 days of vlogmas so they started on december 12th so the first 12 days i think i was doing pretty good because not many people had started vlogmas yet but now people are starting it um my skin is doing a little better it's a little like itchy this morning but as you guys can see that first layer of skin peeled off and it like really made my dark spots a lot lighter um but y'all just want my i want my skin to be good by new year's like if we can get everything nice and cleared up because but i think this is an ingrown hair from my mustache anybody else grow a mustache it's a lady out here um then this kind of popped up but it's going away now this popped up and it's going away now they were like hurting to the touch but not anymore all of them are going away they've dried up but i just want everything completely gone so i can have me a nice clean slate um so yeah about to finish editing my vlogmas i need to also put out another reel but as you can see like i don't look presentable today or feel like i look presentable enough to make a reel nor do i want to like do my hair so We'll see how that goes, but I need to post a reel today as well. Being an influencer is a real thing. Like I said before in one of the other vlogmas, is like, don't let nobody tell you that you are not doing no work if you are actively making, you know, YouTube videos and content for Instagram. Like, don't let nobody tell you that you was not doing work because this is a real thing and it can be tire tiring but i also feel like there's a 30 minute -er, minute -er, minute -er, 30 minute -er, i don't know what i'm trying to say 30 minute nap uh coming over the horizon before i clean up that is something that i feel deep down in my soul um so yeah let me edit my goal is to get this youtube video out and this um, reel out at the same time. And then I can take me a 30 minute nap and then get up and start. Because there's a few clothes that need to be washed. There's stuff that needs to be put up. I'm still not really like unpacked from when I went to Detroit for Thanksgiving. Don't judge me. Judge your mama. Don't judge me. Judge your mama. Pipe down on me. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna catch y'all back in a few. <laughs> Praise the Lord, everybody. Okay, um, so I've done quite a bit of work today. Um, got a reel out, got my vlogmas up way ahead of time because usually I'd be like right now trying to get a vlogmas up, and then I um, what else? And then I got a reel put up for Instagram, which is super dope. Um, and Amazon said I got a pocket, so we're coming for that. And I'm gonna show y'all, of course, it's a part of my fit for new year's i don't think i'm gonna show y'all my new year's outfit until until it's time for new year's 
but other than that, I'm going to show y'all my accessory because it's an accessory. Let's see if I Today I watched this video on YouTube, um, just like some tips on how to um, push your YouTube channel, get more subscribers, more watch time hours. You know, that's the whole goal um, in this influencer style life. Because, you know, the overall goal really is to get this monetized so that you can really like make money off of what you love to do right and so i love to do this i love making the videos and it's not about the money of course because i'm doing this without getting the money from youtube as of now but you know eventually i would like this to pay off so this is on my amazon storefront i will let y'all know that um very sturdy Comes in a little, little shopping bag, little sleeve. Let's see. It smells like, I don't want to say leather, but almost. Okay. This is the bag that I'm wearing for New Year's. Super cute, right? Um, it was like 30 six dollars i think like with shipping and all of that um yeah it has the chain it's cold because it's been outside i'm trying to stay down here until my food comes because my food arrived i just got the memo um I was gonna try to take the chain off, but the chain is like that grayish black metal, which I love. Um, it has the double sided compartments with a zipper in the middle. It's super cute. I think this is what you consider a dupe of another purse. Um, I'm not making too much in here, and y'all see it. But this is, I'll probably carry it like that for New Year's. Um, but cute enough, right? Love it. Okay. Um, my food is at the door now, so let's get our food. <sighs> Praise the Lord. I'm also babysitting tonight, so we'll get some house footage on tonight. We have a whole chair like sitting on the porch for the point of delivery. And these people still just wish to not turn the light off, praise God. No. To not um like just put your food on the ground. So yeah. Dinner tonight, I didn't want my like, fried food, hamburger, or anything like that. So tonight we have Boston Market. And I haven't had Boston Market in since I lived in Michigan. I didn't give me any silverware. I got the prima spinach. Maybe not. Okay, hey y'all. I'm back. <clears throat> and I got some lint. Lint? Is it Lindor or is it just lint? Lindor. Lindor truffles i got five of them and we're gonna try all of them so this is the milk 
Maybe I'll save that one because that might be the safest one. I'm going to start with this one because it looks like it might have like a little peppermint situation going on. <clears throat> By the way, I ate my food and mm, can I say scrum dilly -umptious? Boston Market in Texas, way better than Boston Market in Michigan. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Okay, yeah, it's a peppermint situation. This mm, very pepperminty. This one makes me feel like I should drop this in a cup of hot cocoa. I love a little peppermint in my hot cocoa. It is like a Christmas parade in your mouth. Okay, let's um, go for this. Oh, okay. I just started with a disclaimer. I don't know how I feel about nougat just yet. Like sometimes I like it and then sometimes the texture just kind of throw me off and I'd be like, ooh. Um, of course, it's a truffle, so it has the nougat in the center. I'm just so afraid that it's gonna be nasty. <laughs> yep. Mm -mm. Nope. <laughs> mm -mm. Get somebody else to do it. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. I would still, because it's like white chocolate with the peppermint, I would still maybe like cut it in half and drop it into my hot cocoa. Okay, this one doesn't say anything. It smells a little like dark chocolate. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Um I think it's dark chocolate with like a milk chocolate cream on the inside or something. Ooh. This is the dark blue wrapper. Don't get guys. I mean if that's yours, just have your way. Okay. Let's try this red one. Now this is definitely milk chocolate. I'm not a big chocolate fan unless it has like something in it. I think it's the inside, like, I don't know what it is, it's like it's a, mix between like caramel and milk chocolate or something i'm not for it. that's the red one it's the same inside as the dark chocolate but that's why that one's milk so now i'm kind of feeling like what's the difference okay this one says milk so oh but this one is textured Y'all see? Okay. Before I eat that one, I'm going to open this one up too. Maybe the Lord says save it to the last. So save it for the last. Oh, but this gold wrapper is... It's white chocolate. I'm not a fan of white chocolate either because it's just sugar. I don't like these are too sweet not just enough for me it's white chocolate filled with white chocolate okay please be good in the name of jesus like i was saying i don't like just straight chocolate my boyfriend Always be messing me up in my videos. Leave me alone. Jeez. <laughs> um, I like chocolate with something in it. And not necessarily like more chocolate. 
So this has like crisp wafers and the wafers like take away from the sweetness, you know? Um I'm not a big fan of like super sweet, but I'm a huge fan of sweet and savory. So give me a nice salted pretzel covered in chocolate. Y'all, this is why you can't do nothing with other Negroes around. Um, but still, I think I just had to like try too many sweet things and It's still very sweet, though. I can do without Lindor. So, boyfriend, don't buy me no Lindor chocolates, okay? Thank you. Um, yeah. But I'm halfway through the new episode of Gossip Girl that dropped today. It looked like I had one earring in my ear. I was about to freak out. I'm supposed to be like, these earrings is too expensive to be falling out. Um, have y'all ever had that, like, one of your studs get lost in the sheets or something? Oh, my gosh. But these are pretty sturdy. And these are, too. <clears throat> um, so, I'm going to finish watching this episode of Gossip Girl. And then we're going to talk about it. I feel like we just talk about shows. <laughs> But I just have time. And then a new episode of Sex Lives of College Girls came out. But I don't know how many people are actually watching that. And I told y'all last vlog to like go and watch it. So go watch it so we can talk about it. I need some friends to talk about it with. Although I have my cousin. Yeah, I need some water because that was... Too sweet. I love it today. Did I say that earlier in the vlog? I'm giving Tanya Baxter. <laughs> I am giving Tanya Baxter realness on today. I don't know when I'm going to take the plats out. Um, I have a feeling like in my gut that like my hair grew some from when I cut it but then it's like girl please like here don't grow to FS but you know like God can work a miracle in the matter of seconds so you never know what he does for his people um no I'm just kidding but yeah I told y'all already that I'm babysitting tonight Miles is downstairs his father is still here so um his dad is still here, so he's, what is this? Uh, so he's down there right now, but he's probably about to leave. Oh, he's probably not gonna leave until like another hour or so. So let me catch up on Gossip Girl and uh, Sex Lives of College Girls so I can get that out of the way before Miles gets up here and rudely interrupts me. Um, Cause once his dad leaves, he's gonna be up here. All right, you know, that kid is, like, afraid of everything. It's kind of crazy. Yep. All right. Nice chatting with you. I'm going to go finish watching Gossip Girl. I'm going to finish chatting. And this is what the rest of my night looks like. What are you showing them? The cars. The cars. He got one car for what's which one's my favorite color? Red. And which one's your favorite color? Green. Yeah. So he got a car for the both of us. One in his favorite color and one in my favorite color. Isn't he the sweetest little thing ever? Yes. And he's such a clean, smelling good. <sighs> Smell good boy. He smells so good. Stinky. Why would you say <laughs> stinky? <laughs> Sorry about that. You can't tell the people my boyfriend's name. What did you learn at school today? Uh, I learned about 
I went. I learned it about. What are you doing? What did you learn about? Now, what, do I, what did I just learn about? Wait, I learned it about. 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 Uh. <laughs> You don't even remember. Do you know what you I did today? I learned it about sur soldiers. Okay, what about soldiers? My dad's a soldier. Aww. Your dad's a soldier? In the army of the Lord? Yes, my dad's a soldier. In the army of the Lord? Yes, in the army of the Lord. Okay, praise God. Each of, definitely in the army each of, of these cars can mm -hmm. power down because they... Deep because they only go deep in the water. This is gonna be the water, and this is gonna be the roads. So green is mine, and red is yours. Okay, thank you so much. Now we just have to go under the water. Okay, mm -hmm. we're about to play with these cars, and um, yeah. Okay, I'll and catch back up. With done, Clearly, yeah. I'm tired, yeah. so we'll see how the then night goes. Not, not, and then hey y'all. So it is currently. 12.55 a.m. I put Miles to sleep at about 9.30. Then I hopped in the shower, did all of those good things. And then, um, what else? I hopped in the shower, put him to bed, and then I started some laundry. So I'm still currently doing laundry um, because all that cleaning that I said that I, I was going to do, I am now doing it at the wee hours of the morning. Anybody else get the cleaning bug? Like, in the wee hours of the morning, especially when I had the mind to do it, I have to go ahead and do it before I lay down and go to sleep, or I'm not going to get good rest. So, I want to get this done, and then when I go to bed, I can just go to bed, and all of it's done, everything is put in its place, and we're good, and, um, yeah. So, I am up at the wee hours of the morning, finishing up everything that I said I was going to do. Got my trash out of my bathroom. I even cleaned out uh, my purse because I've, like, been avoiding it. I want to carry it because it's the tote um, that I have. But I haven't been wanting to carry it because from, like, my previous job and airport runs and stuff, like, I just dumped everything in it. So it needed a massive clean out and I was able to take a lot of crap out of it. Um, and now I feel like I'm taking care of the bag because I don't have to put as much stuff as I had in there before um, due to my job. So now basically just my wallet and some pins are in there and let's see how long we can keep it like that. Next task is cleaning out my book bag because I haven't fully cleaned out my book bag since I um, left my job. So I, I need to do that because I'm sure there's a lot of crap in there and I'm just pushing stuff around, making stuff fit. Um, so yeah, that is what I am currently doing at almost 1 a.m. in the morning. <sighs> Y'all wish me luck. Let me know. Don't don't have me out here like I'm um, some strange person. Like, for real, let me know. Does anybody else get the cleaning bug in the wee hours of the morning? I can get the, the cleaning. <coughs> Excuse me, Lord. I can get the cleaning bug at any time of the day, honestly. Especially when I have my mind set on cleaning. And, um... I'll be transparent and honest. I used to be extremely junky and then something flipped in life, maybe age or something, and I stopped being that way. Um, but now I've noticed that me being a little more junkier or not taking care of like my space is due to my emotions and how I'm feeling in the moment. Um, and so I think in a previous vlog, I did divulge that I go through like kind of some waves of like I'm not going to say depression, but just like 
some down days, some up days, and they come and they go. And so um, I found myself in a little funk for a little bit. And now I'm like, we got to get out the funk. We got to clean our room. We got to make everything bright and smelling clean. So I like candles, all of those good things. And we're getting it done. Um, and this is just me being real. Judge me if you want to judge me, whatever it may be. Um, but this is my process. This is how I stay sane. Um, I think everyone should have a therapist. I, no matter who you are, um, everyone needs someone to talk to. Everyone needs a, a sound mind to go to for good judgment and all those things. Um, and just to help, my god mom calls it, help you keep your car in the middle of the road, okay? Because we can all get off every now and then. You know, when you doze off on the road and you hear that, yeah, like sometimes we get over there a little bit and we stay on that for a long time. Um, so I'm just getting back, getting my car back in the middle of the road. So yeah, uh, wish me luck. Hopefully I can get in the bed at least by like within the next hour. I want to wash. Yeah, so all of my loads are in except for one, which are my jeans. I want to wash that, get that out the way. Um, and I'm putting up the loads as I go because if I don't put up the loads, they're not going to get put up. So I'm putting them up as I go. Um, yeah, the thing that I'm really like... <laughs> avoiding is I got all of the trash out of my bathroom um but I still have like uh, my hair products and stuff on the counter and I usually don't really have anything on my counter at all so I need to like take all of that stuff off of the counter and I'm avoiding that um so yeah wish me luck y'all I'm gonna show y'all um the end result after I finish cleaning all right hey y'all so